Steve Daniel, a senior natural resources management specialist at the World Bank with many years of experience in the Terra Africa program and now recently settled in here in Addis, is our man to wind up the show this evening. Steve? Okay, thank you, Dennis. Thank you, uh, my colleagues at the table. Um, I'm going to talk a little bit about uh, the perspective, country perspective and investment programming uh, and, and what we've done that could be uh, useful uh, for Jeff Six programming with the mm -hmm. new food security uh, program. Um, the, the bank, of, first of all, is interested in supporting our client governments uh, in pursuing a, developing an investment program on, uh, on resilience, environmental security, food security, climate security. Essentially, it's all about economic security at the end of the day. Um, focusing on East and Southern Africa and the challenges that my, my colleagues have already presented uh, using a lot of the technologies that my colleague from AGRA has also discussed. Um, we've been talking to uh, Norway, uh, the GEF, NAPAD, uh, on uh, developing this program, but we've not started talking yet to uh, client governments. This was uh, a next step, and this is a, the very earliest stages of the investment dialogue. Um, we have a track record for developing these kinds of programs and deploying GEF resources strategically, and we try to deploy a, a, a number of partners, uh, a number of sources of knowledge, uh, and a number of financing sources from carbon to GEF to concessional lending to trust funds from bilateral sources uh, to scale up. Right now, we, are, we have a $1.1 billion program for the Sahel that's under implementation. It's called the uh, Sahel and West Africa program in support of the Great Green Wall Initiative. And the Great Green Wall Initiative is an existing uh, partnership founded by the heads of state of Africa and uh, including the Maghreb countries and uh, is headed by the African Union. Um, so our, the portfolio that we are supporting is $1.1 billion. It includes uh, projects in, <coughs> a project in Nigeria that's, <coughs> excuse me, that's focusing on, uh, on uh, erosion control, uh, a food security project in Chad, uh, disaster risk management and sustainable land management program in Togo, uh, and here in Ethiopia, a program that I'm the task leader for, which is the sustainable land management project uh, that includes a component on land certification and, and focuses on watershed rehabilitation and uh, farmland development. There, is, uh, 12, there are 12 country investment operations in that portfolio, and those are just some of them. And there's also a regional hub project that is the glue for these 12 country projects to come together and uh, do more than they could uh, individually. Uh, this regional project is called uh, Building Resilience for Innovation, Communication, and Knowledge Services, or BRICS, another brick in the wall, if you will. And it's implemented by the Interstate Committee for Drought Control in the Sahel, and the Sahara and Sahel Observatory, and IUCN, which brings uh, some some expertise on biodiversity planning, uh, since that's another important component of agricultural landscapes, sometimes is overlooked. Um, uh, I'm, I'm also managing that project as well, and uh, we're always seeking ways to bring together the different country teams working on the investment operations, and also uh, uh, policymakers from the different uh, countries, so that uh, the, the investment dialogue, the policy dialogue, capacity building, the scaling up is all part of one uh, coordinated effort. All of this is done in the context of the broader CATAP and Terra Africa program. Uh, the Terra Africa portfolio is, is, is uh, double that size again, $3 billion. We often don't make a, a big show of that. That's a NAPAD program the World Bank is a proud member of. Um, looking forward, uh, uh, as, uh, as Mohamed Bakar said from the GEF, uh, the initial ideas of the food security program of the GEF is uh, exactly that, an initial idea. Uh, we're happy to be part of that dialogue and, and, and to discuss where it could go and, and, and what shape it could look like and how we could work with our partners and, and most importantly, our client governments to, to make it work. Thank you. Thank you.